Hello everybody, welcome. It's Aqueous here bringing you another Honkai Star Rail video. And today we're going to be continuing with the event that we've been doing. Um, the Star Hunt game event. I don't know why there's no... Oh, there is audio, okay. Never mind, my, uh, my headset was just... Oh, I guess this guy isn't voice acted. That's fine. Doesn't actually really matter to me that much. Okay, so Aether Graffiti. Use the graffiti mechanisms in the stage to break out of the sealed sector. Glare the current challenge. All allies are knocked down for no more than no more than two times. What does that do? I don't know what that means. Look at all hacking call card graffitis. Okay, and then I assume we can encounter battles. I wonder if this is going to be kind of like a Ah, uh, we can't use support characters. Unfortunate. Um, wonder if this is going to be some kind of... Just like in the story mode where we had the... Simulated world type thing. I wonder if this will be like that. I'm not sure exactly what I go here. Physical, ice, and quantum. I don't have any quantum. I have one ice and I have one physical. Except for Natasha. So I guess I can just go Ting Yun to kind of buff. I guess that, that makes actually the most sense. Okay. So you can discover many strange graffiti in various locations of the zone. Okay. Okay, so we need to find the graffiti. But in that image there, we saw those graffiti above the door. So we can try looking at that. And what does this do? Oh, okay. I can recover my team's HP. Interesting. Ah, okay. So it had this above the door. And it has it right here, so we just take a picture of it, and it opens the door. Okay. We should see if there's any other graffiti around here. There is. Okay, they're hacking call cards. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> So we want to find all of those in order to get the 20 more Stellar Jades. So we just want to keep our eyes peeled everywhere that we go for this kind of stuff. Apparently we can't get into there. I don't know if we're supposed to get into there though. Find any more hack and call cards. I don't really see any currently. We'll start up this battle. Okay. You couldn't have done it without. Good for us. Go to the other door. Oh, hey, look. Who oh, no. knew? There's one over there as well, so let's do this little puzzle. Another walking puzzle. Uh. Yeah, we messed it up. Basically, like went forward on it. We just want to make sure that we get all of those. And now let's start a fight with these guys. Wow, there's a lot of damage. This is looking pretty easy for now. We'll have to see if the higher difficulties actually increase it by a significant amount. If not, then this will probably have kind of the same 
have the same issues with this as I did the Boulder Town Super League event. Okay, so we scan this and then that opens the door all the way across again. Yep, that one. And it looks like that's where we fight the boss. I can kind of see him through the door. So I don't see any other graffiti. I think we're going to be good. I think that's all of the crawling cards. We take a right here. Into a left. We of course look for any graffiti anywhere before we start off that fight. Freeze. 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 Okay. That's pretty huge. There we go. Now she gets her ult so she'll kill all the minions. Oh no, she almost does it. Seems decently easy enough. At least I think. Okay. I had the option to say it's either so easy or so difficult. I wonder if that actually changes anything. That would be kind of cool if it did. It's like I think we're good on calling cards. Let's see. Yep, okay, I did. So we got all of those rewards, a piece of gear. Uh, actually not bad. Crit damage, effect hit and effect resist. Okay, cool. That's difficulty one. All right, well, that's difficulty one. I think I'm going to separate these into different episodes because, like I said, I'm trying to um, give myself time to make more uh, more edited, more kind of constructed content, and I am utilizing the, you know, the gameplay, the more gameplay videos to kind of uh, fill in there. So obviously the gameplay of these will be pretty short unless they increase, unless they actually increase the difficulty by a decent amount and uh, increase the length of them. But uh, yeah, this is going to be difficulty one of the sealed sector completed. Uh, this event is looking really good. I will do a video for each of the different difficulties. Obviously I did a video for uh, getting all the pictures. And then after that, Right at the day after those all release, I'll have the uh, full event review coming up uh, and will be uploaded. So, you know, it's maybe you can look at this and say this is like kind of a lazy, uh, this is semi lazy content. And yes, it is. But it's also how I get more than one video out a day. Uh, it's still it's still content, though. You know, it's still something you can put on the background, but. It's also how I can get more than one video out, video out a day some days, and also what gives me time to make really good, way more edited, um, fun to watch videos, such as the review for this. So thank you all for watching and have a wonderful day. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it, you know? Uh, I wanna hear your opinions and also make sure you put those in the comments section. Um, and collect the rewards here. Thank you all for watching.